We're at the Michon's Auctions Annex Auction uh, pre-sale setup here for the October 6th and 7th Annex Auction. And we're going to take a look at some of the highlights of the things that, that will be out in, in the auction. And they're still setting up, so there are a lot of things that we can't necessarily get to yet. But um, let's see what is coming up. Lot number 511, we have a tall dresser, which is in really, really good shape. It's got a marble top and uh, six drawers. It looks like it came with the key as well, which is not necessarily that common to actually find these in, in such good shape and actually have the key. So let's get an overall view. There's a lot of different things. The artwork has not been set up on the back wall, so I can't give you a preview of that yet. But there is a lot of artwork in the aisles. Asian furniture. Looks like some mallets. Here we have an Asian re relief carving. Of what it looks like some sort of a festival or a battle scene. Lot number 509. This thing's really heavy, solid wood. A painting of the Pope. Bicycles. Looks like a taxidermy wild turkey. No home should be without one. Artwork. Contemporary couch, wine racks, burlwood table. Oh, this is a nice table here. Looks like a breakfast nook. Lot number 641 with two tables. Looks like it might be fairly new, but it's in great condition. Here's a nice dresser. Asian style Tansu. Lot number 531 is a shift's wheel. All you need is a ship to go along with it. Or a place to put it. Ladies' hats, those were popular last, uh, last month. like we got some stereo equipment here, a couple of errants, model 250 receiver and amplifier. Here's a really nice uh, bedroom suite, mirror top, lot number 987. Looks like it's this whole row pretty much. Here we have a, an interesting rug. I'm not sure what design it is, but it will be lot number 527. Really good color. Doesn't look really faded or anything like that. Some Asian style chairs. Rocking chair.
here is an electric bike, which from what I've seen earlier, somebody has test rode it and it works fine. Um, not necessarily for freeway speeds or anything like that, but maybe just getting around and having some fun. This is a Casino Pit Boss booth, which you don't get those very often in auction. But it looks very authentic. And that is lot number. Well, it hasn't been lotted yet. We have some taxidermy deer heads here. In the back wall we have some fur coats, look like they're mink. Minky's furs, oh that, that's a dead giveaway right there. This is a lot of a set of Nortake China. China. Lot, well, lot number 869. So here we've gotten some shots of some of the, uh, the highlights that are coming up in next week's auction. The auction, again, will be held on Tuesday and Wednesday, October 6th and 7th, and uh, beginning at 10 a.m. Each, each, each day. Uh, the first day starts off with a lot of jewelry which I think will probably be around 100 to 200 lots at least. And we couldn't preview that today because it's not here. Um, so anyway, there seems to be something for everyone, so come take a look.